What's up guys, NerdOfDesk here, and today I'm going to show you how to put a second hard drive inside of your laptop. Okay, so you realize you either need more storage space inside of your laptop, or you need an SSD, but you don't want to buy like a 500 gigabyte SSD, which can run into well more than $500 range. What you can do is install a secondary hard drive inside of your laptop. Now, here's just one I'm going to be showing, um, but here is a Lenovo that I have. I've reviewed it before. Um, let's say that um, I want to get an SSD in here, but I don't want to spend a lot of money. I can get about a 60 gigabyte SSD or a 128 gigabyte SSD and put it in the main slot of the hard drive. But then you might be wondering, you would only have two, 128 gigabytes of space, which is a lot, but not enough for a computer. Um, what you can do is take out your optical drive here and uh, do what's called a optical drive hard drive caddy. And you actually have to take the laptop apart. You put a uh, your already your hard drive on here. Like I have a 500 gigabyte 52 RPM hard drive in here. You put that inside of the hard drive caddy. So you actually take your optical drive out of your laptop and then you put in the caddy. And basically what this does is adds another hard drive to the system. So you would have another hard drive. So in turn, I would have 128 plus 500 gigabytes of storage, which is is good. And I would also have the speed of an SSD, but the storage that I would need can be all be done inside of the secondary hard drive installed in the optical drive bay. But you might be wondering, okay, now I don't have an optical drive anymore. Well, there's a very easy solution to that. You can get a USB optical hard drive, or optical drive, sorry. And I actually built this one. Um, in links below, hold on, I have to unbox this. Okay. So, uh, I got an optical drive out of an old computer, but in this case, you can have the one that's already in your computer after you put in the new hard drive caddy. Uh, this enclosure is going to be linked below. I bought it. It costs about five dollars. Uh, you just plug it in, and then you have USB connection. And there you go. You have a USB one, or you can just spend the twenty bucks and get another one. This was super easy to put together. The only thing is that the front faceplate didn't fit on there, so I had to take it off. But other than that, that works well. But finding the right hard drive caddy for your laptop might be a little bit difficult. Um, if you're looking for something cheaper, you can go with the links below, both links for the, um, I'll have links for the caddy for this as well as the, uh, the optical drive, hard drive caddy. Uh, it's, oh, where's your friends? Um, with that, you can, um, like, you can spend like five dollars and get the generic one that will most likely work, but it won't exactly, like, fit well with the finish of your laptop like it'll just kinda like instead of it being rounded right here it's just gonna be like a flat edge and look kinda weird but uh, you know it will work and it'll be only five dollars now there's another website that makes specialized ones these cost from anywhere to forty to sixty dollars and uh... but will be guaranteed to fit as well as match the color right here right here sorry I have the hiccups but I'm gonna include the links to that below uh... just explore around with it I haven't seen much documentation online but how to you know fully put a second hard drive in your optical bay but it is possible unless you're a lucky person that has a hard drive with two uh, two uh, or a laptop with two hard drive bays uh, then you're lucky but if not you're like you just want you know a secondary hard drive for extra storage or you want to put an SSD uh, you can't run any raids on this laptops usually don't support raid so that's the only really downside of that but other than that Fully recognizable, fully functional. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys.